The not a mod class is from buying the not a mod T-shirt from the the Hero Mart store, um, Nade. So it's 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 basically a pay to win shirt, right? Like you you get it from, sorry, a pay to win class. You get it from buying a real life item and then you get the class. I don't know how good the class is. That's what we're gonna find out. I've seen a few people make make a video on it, but I've never really looked at the class itself. That that is why I'm leveling leveling it up right now. Um. So, I want to find out if it's good. I mean, I'm, it looks like I'm doing good damage. Uh, but that is also because I'm using enhancements. So. Obsidian Palant. It's a very good class, Saffron. I enjoy it. It's not really as good as Chronos. Yeah, I imagine, like, when we compare things to Chronos, I feel like a lot of classes aren't very good. Uh, Hunter Gray, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Having a good day. Welcome, welcome. Um... Yeah, if we compare it to Chronos, it's probably not going to be that good. But what I want to see is, can you use the class? So, like, is it completely unviable or can we use it? Right, it's now rank 10. That was very quick. Thank you for the help. So, let's read what this skill does. Uh, a short range attack that deals damage to one target. Don't think about the this skill does just... Don't think about this skill... A what? Sorry, there's a what. That's That's how bad my dyslexia is. Don't think about what the skill does. Just use it because it comes off cooldown really fast. Deals stacking bonus damage and increases your dodge by 10%. If the last skill skill used was this one up to 15 times, using another skill removes the dodge and damage bonus can't crit. If you're caffeinated, the skill can crit and it builds your combo count, increasing your crit damage by 20% for 3 seconds. Stacks to 15. Um... This is a completely average hit, which does perfect, perfectly normal damage. What do you mean? This is just another auto attack. You want this skill to actually do something? Okay, fine. If you want a way for this class to recover mana that badly, this skill now fully recovers your mana. Are you happy? Okay. Uh, gamer fuel. Eat a handful of chips, healing you and applying fuel, increasing your hit chance and haste by 20% for 20 seconds. If you have three stacks of gamer rage, you also chug an energy drink, apply as caffeinated, Causing all skills to crit, reducing mana cost by 100%, healing you over time, increasing your haste, hit chance, and dodge by 100% for 15 seconds. Drinking your energy drink quells your rage. So, uh, furious that your button mashing is getting you nowhere, you throw your keyboard at your target in a fit of rage, dealing increased damage based on how much you, uh, you button mashed, and stunning them for 3 seconds. Smashing your keyboard generates a stack of Gamer Rage, removes any active combo count you have, can't miss. Oh, it has nice animations. Let's have a look. I mean, the class itself sounds like it'd be good, pretty good for uh, bosses, right? It sounds like it'd be pretty good for. What's a good? What's a good bo uh, boss? Best best viewers on Star Star Star. Thank you, Keck. I look, it's another Keck. Boris, can you ban it? The shirts be kind of they are nade I, I don't i i'm not a big fan of recommending you buy stuff from the hero mart it, it's very 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 good um ultra daily do you think i get away with doing it in time in i don't know if i'm gonna have enough health we can try it though if somebody wants to go lord of order and arch paladin we can try it so what should i use here I think Dauntless will be very good, right? Because I'm going to be using that too a lot. So Dauntless will be very good. Do I just try full damage? Anima and Bane. Do I just go full damage here? Poor Kek. He's in Africa right now, so... It was it was the fake Kek. And the fake Kek. All right, let's give it a go. So... Uh, what does this do? So if you if you if you were to get three stacks of keyboard smash, you'd you'd get a hundred percent dodge, which I guess wouldn't really it wouldn't really matter on in this case. But yeah, let's give it a go. I'll see how much damage I can do. Hopefully, I don't get one tapped because of my low health. But animations are on. Yes. Well, I four animations. Oh, I locked. I locked my two ability because I'm stupid. Let me die. I should have just locked the five ability. How you doing, Grim? 
If I'm using Dauntless, I should definitely, uh... <laughs> I don't think I don't think you can test uh, not a mod in the ultra fight. What's my favorite class? Timekeeper. I think I need a boss that's not gonna kill me so quickly and lock my things. I, I don't think that I'm gonna be able to use not a mod here. Not without going full luck at least. Yeah. No, I swing. I swing again. Has too much damage. I need to kill something that isn't gonna one tap me. Yeah, time timekeeper is my favorite class, though. I'm doing good, thank you, blood. Thank you for asking. <coughs> How you doing, Jake? Or how you doing, Nah? Yeah, but. I have to get three stacks of it for it to be a hundred percent. I could maybe I could use Vim, but I don't think it would work. Yeah, this is a waste of time because I'm not I, I'm not really able to test it here. I'm not even bothered about my timing. Uh, what's another boss chat? Wait, couldn't I just try it in class hall? I always forget about this. Couldn't I just try it here? Let's have a look. We'll, we'll go. We'll, we'll, we won't change the enhancements. Let's have a look. So if I go, if I start with this, so it doesn't get the combo, and I just spam two. Is this gonna? Is this gonna work? That's the question. That is the question. So if I use that, and then I use this, do I get a 100% crit chance, right? Oh my god, I do. Interesting. Huh. Does that, so does that own, does that only, how long does that last? 15 seconds, right? Huh. What could you, what could you pair that with? Yeah, it's 15 seconds. The, the, the question with a lot of these classes is when are you going to use it, right? Like, when, it, when are you really going to use it? Do Ultra Engineer. Engineer probably would have been a better choice, but... So you're, guarant you're basically guaranteed to crit once you use that. So... I feel like Dauntless is definitely the best enhancement. That you can use. Yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't think of, a, I can't think of a niche moment though, like when you would really use the class. I mean, it has some good animations, it, which is literally just the throwing the keyboard. I don't know if there's meant to be any more animations than that, but it seems to only be the one animation on the keyboard, which is pretty cool. Well, Dauntless, Dauntless applies when you use your 2 ability, and 2 is very spammable in this class. So... No, I've had it for ages, Howie, but I haven't, I haven't leveled it up. I just fought to level it up today. This class is just a hide to mid, it really can't survive much. Yeah, you wouldn't use this in, um... You wouldn't, you wouldn't use this in Ultras, 100%. There'd be no need for it. I think Chaos Avenger, yeah, Chaos Avenger's good. It's just, I, I'm just a big fan of the, um, I'm just a big fan of, um, Timekeeper. Yeah. I, I don't actually know when you would use this. Maybe somebody else knows when you, this class would become viable. I mean, it's a cool collector's item, which is pretty much what you're getting it for, right? If you do decide to get this class, you're pretty much getting it just as a collector's item. For the funny, not a mod. Like, I can't really see you getting this class thinking it's going to be OP. So. Uh, 
Uh, it's just a nice... I, I think it's a nice collector's item. That's my opinion. I know this is a little bit underwhelming. <laughs> but, yeah. I don't have much else to say on it. <laughs>